in like general speaking, like what we have is uh, we have a, a block run mode and also a shift register mode for like I mean actually two solutions to these two projects, and we found like the block run one is not that perfect, and the shift register one is more um, low level but like more stable one. So that's so we're gonna go into the testing. And this is the FPGA board, and, and we're first like doing the reset of the data using steep switch, and then we are going to um, process the image by this MATLAB platform. And I click running, and you can see all these green lights in the FPGA board are the real data that going through and processing. And the two yellow lights uh, are the trans transmitter and the receiver, which read and write all the data. It's a signal that indicate that. And actually, like they are in the same frequency of this lighting, so it's actually like reading and writing the same frequency. And we must like wait for a long time. We set a long, larger pause uh, between each pixel value. The reason is because we want a smooth uh, processing. And actually, when we got enough dependent data, uh, the processing unit will start to process the input. Yeah? Okay, here we are. This is the intensity threshold. And you can see like the comparatively lighter, like the body of the horse, or, uh, I don't know, is become white and actually the background, which is dark, become purely black. And now uh, let's switch to the um, medium filter mode. Yeah, we need to reset first and then go to the medium filter mode. And now, I should run it. <laughs> and here we go. You can see um, the process, the image is more uh, blurred, and actually the noise inside the image was decreased. So this is the block RAM for our medium filter. Um, at first, we have a perfect VRAM, and then here's the image we get um, for medium filtering. Oopsie. Yep. Um, but um, yesterday, our VRAM crashed, and it starts to lose half of the data. So what we did is um, we start the program and then here we run it. Yeah, it's running. So what we did is we manually um, duplicate each data and then put it into the image. So the output image is the same size. Now it's ready. And this is the output image. You can see the pixel is like two times because we manually duplicate the one. But um, at first, we have a really good medium filter result. Nice.